It's the aviation debate that has triggered turbulence across Australia, and now travellers on the receiving end of the decision have spoken out. Australia's government has faced mounting scrutiny since blocking Qatar Airways from adding 21 more flights into the country. The CEO of Qantas, Alan Joyce, supported the government's decision during a Senate committee session and argued that allowing extra Qatar Airways flights would disrupt the market equilibrium. However, in recent weeks, officials, aviation experts, and Australia's competition watchdog have stood against Against that decision, saying it would have decreased airfares. Now, a social media users commenting on a Guardian Australia video on the issue have spoken out to make clear where they stand. An overwhelming majority pointed to Qatar Airways as the favorable airline, criticizing Qantas over high airfares. One person said, quote, Qatar is the most affordable way I can see family in New Zealand. Qantas and Air NZ are so unaffordable. Another claimed, quote, the government is colluding with Qantas to keep flight prices high and they're using geopolitics as an excuse. In another comment, one person said, quote, stop protecting Qantas, make them learn to compete. The comments came as the Australian Competition and Consumer Commission finally joined in on the debate, debunking claims by Qantas that more flights would not have impacted airfares. The government is under pressure to disclose the reasons for rejecting the Qatari request, which is believed to have come following lobbying from Qantas. But with officials in Australia now pushing to disclose documents related to that decision and explanation could be on the horizon.